hello everyone today i want to show you how to simplify this nice algebraic expression uh, into the lowest form uh, so here uh, you see that a calculator is not allowed in this problem it means that uh, we need to show all of the working on this paper so if we have 64 to the power of 4 minus 32 to the power of 5 so we write this algebraic expression into the lowest form I hope so you like this method but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section so here the very first step we are going to do is here first we need to focus in the base of the first term and the exponent of the second term and now we break this base as this is 64 we write it as 2 times of 32 and its whole power is 4 minus this is uh, 32 to the power of 5 and we break this 5 as 4 plus 1 and now here further in the next step we need to use here the nice uh, exponent laws and you know that uh, if we have a multiplied by b and its whole power is m we write it as a to the power of m multiplied by b to the power of m so in the first term we apply here this nice exponent law and in the second term uh, we apply this exponent law if you have a to the power of m plus n we write it as a to the power of m multiplied by b to the power of n so according to this uh, these two exponent laws uh, we break the first term as uh, here we write it as 2 to the power of 4 multiplied by 32 to the power of 4 minus and in the second term we apply the second exponent law and it will be written as 32 to the power of 4 multiplied by 32 to the power of 1 and now you see here both of these terms involve 32 to the power of 4 so that here we take common 32 to the power of 4 and we get the remaining values are here we obtain a 2 to the power of 4 minus here when you take common 32 to the power of 4 we get the remaining value is 32 only uh, and now here you clearly see that 2 to the power of 4 is equals to 16. So now we replace this 2 to the power of 4 is equals to 16 and over this expression is written as first you have 32 to the power of 4 into when you replace this 2 to the power of 4 equals 16 here it will becomes 16 minus 32 and we write it as 32 to the power of 4 into this is 16 minus 32 is equals to minus 16 and now you see here uh, because calculator is not allowed in this problem so that's why i can do all of these uh, calculations uh, and now here our next target is to find the value of 32 to the power of 4 so 32 to the power of 4 here we again break this exponent and we write it as 2 plus 2 we break this 4 as 2 plus 2 and it will be written as 32 square multiplied by 32 square so here our first we need to find the value of this 32 square so uh, 32 square means that we multiply 32 with 32 and also uh, we break this 32 as in this form we write it as 30 plus 2 and <clears throat> in the next step uh, we multiply this 32 on both of these values and it will be written as 32 multiplied by 30 and plus 32 multiplied by 2 and now first we need to multiply these two bigger numbers and you see here i can just multiply these two bigger numbers directly without any calculations or without any calculator uh, so here we first consider this is one digit number and this is our two digit number okay so when we multiply 0 with this number you get 0 when we multiply 3 with this number you get here 3 2 is a 6 and 3 3 is a 9 plus in the same pattern we multiply 2 with this 32 and you see here 2 2 is a 4 and 2 3 is a 6 so uh, we get here 32 square equals to these values and now we need to add these two values and you see here 0 plus 4 becomes 4 and 6 plus 6 becomes 12 we write 2 and carry 1 so this is 9 plus 1 uh, equals to 10 it means that 32 square is equals to uh, 1024 
so now here we move backward and we replace these two 32 square equals to 1024 so 32 to the power of 4 is written as in this form so we have 32 to the power of 4 equals to uh, 32 square multiplied by 32 square so 32 square equals to 1024 we put these values here and it will becomes 1024 multiplied by 1024 and now here uh, we break this 1024 as this is 1024 and we break these values as 1000 and plus 20 and plus 4. So when we multiply 1024 with, with each of these values it will be written as 1024 and we place these three zeros here and plus we multiply this value here it will be written as 1024 multiplied by 20 and 1024 multiplied by this 4 and now further uh, we need uh, to multiply these to bigger numbers without using the calculator and you see here we have we again consider this is one digit number and this is two digit numbers so when we multiply 0 with this number you get here 0 and 2 times of this number is equals to 2 4 8 2 2 4 2 0 are 0 and 2 1 are 2 and plus here we need to multiply 4 with this number and you see here 4 4 is a 16 we write 6 and carry 1 4 2 is a 8 8 plus 1 is 9 4 0 is a 0 and 4 1 is a 4 so we get here 4096 so here in the uh, now in next step we need to sum up all of these values and you see here 0 plus 0 plus 6 is equals to 6 this 0 plus 8 becomes 8 8 plus 9 becomes 17 we write 7 and carry 1 so this 0 plus 4 is 4 4 plus 0 is 4 and 4 plus 1 becomes here 5 and we get again 4 plus 0 is 4 4 plus 4 is 8 and in the next step we have this is 2 plus 2 is 4 and we get only two values remaining this is 0 and 1 so we have this is 32 to the power of 4 is equals to this value okay and now we again move backward and we have we need to put this value 32 to the power of 4 here and now we multiply this value by minus 16 uh, so that finally we have the given question statement is that 64 to the power of 4 minus 32 to the power of 5 is equals to uh, this will be written as 32 to the power of 4 multiplied by minus 16 so here we need to put this uh, the value 34 to the power of 4 here and it will be written as here <coughs> we, we write this negative sign in the front of these terms <clears throat> and it will be written as 1048576 and we break this 16 as 10 plus 6 and now uh, in the next step uh, we need to uh, multiply this number on both of these values and when you multiply this number with 10 we can just write this 10 here and it will becomes minus 1048576 and we can just place one zero here and minus uh, we need to multiply six with this number and you see here six six uh, third six times of uh, six becomes 36 uh, and we write here six and carry three so again you have a uh, six seven uh, 42 42 plus three becomes here uh, 45 we write five and carry four so again 6 times of 5 becomes 30, 30 plus 4 becomes 34, we write 4 and carry 3. So uh, 6, 8 is a 48, 48 plus 3 becomes here 51, we write 1 and carry 5. So 6, 4 is a 24, 24 plus 5 becomes 29, we write 29 here because this is 0, okay. So 6, 1 is a 6. So this is the multiplication of these numbers and now here in the final step we need to add these two values and this is our final answer. Here you see that this is the uh, subtraction of two numbers so subtraction of two these are both are negative terms which means that we need to add these two values. So you add these two values here and 0 plus 6 becomes here 6 this 6 plus 5 becomes 11 we write 1 and carry 1 so this 7 plus 4 becomes 11 11 plus 1 is 12. 
we write 2 and carry 1 so this 5 plus 1 is 6 6 plus 1 is 7 and this 8 plus 9 becomes 17 we write 7 and carry 1 so this 4 plus 2 is 6 6 plus 1 is again 7 and this 0 plus 6 becomes 6 and at the last we have this is 1 because these two values are negative so we can place here the negative sign so this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos